I'm Mayanti Langa, and can I just say it's a pleasure to join you here in this magical venue. We are about to witness a never-before-seen phenomenon, an icon of dynamic design, superfluous luxury, and a power-packed performance. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready to make way for the most feature-rich car ever, the Maruti Suzuki Sias. To get things started, I'd like to call upon Managing Director and the CEO of Maruti Suzuki, Mr. Kenichi Ayukawa. Sir, if you could join us on stage, please, to share your vision and plans for rolling out the Maruti Suzuki Sias in the Indian market. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm delighted to welcome you today to this global launch of CLs. This is an interesting time for Indian automobile industry. After three years of slowdown, some signs of growth are visible. Maruti Suzuki has been able to show around 15% growth this year and we improved our market share to around 45%. The festive season is adding to the positive sentiment around us. In the midst of all this, we are very happy to present Superstar Sears to India. We have designed this car keeping in mind the needs and expectations of the Indian sedan customers. The car has great looks, push interiors, and effort, generous room, and comfort. CL Diesel is India's most fuel-efficient car today. We are supporting this great product with effective communication and new initiative in our network. Just a few days back, Honorable Prime Minister Modi invited the global industry major to come and make in India. I'm delighted to share that Maruti Suzuki will make CS in India with over 98% localized level. I'm thankful to our vendor partners who made this possible. And in the coming times, CS will be exported from India to several countries around the world. Ladies and gentlemen, in the last 30 years, Maruti has received tremendous support from India and Indian customers. In recent years, that bond has become stronger. Successive models launched by Maruti Suzuki has been highly successful. Last February, the Selenio was launched globally at Auto Expo in New Delhi. Today, India is a center for another global launch. Millions of Indian customers have owned and enjoyed Maruti Suzuki car and made them best sellers. These customers are looking to upgrade to a um, mid-sized sedan. The CS is for them. We are excited about initial response to CS. Over 10,000 customers have booked the car even before the price is announced. This reflects their confidence in brand Maruti Suzuki. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the media, I want to say a big thank you to all of you for your support and positive coverage. I wish you the best for the festive season.
Thank you very much, Emily San. Thank you for that insight. And of course, it makes us feel very excited. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you have an idea of the plans for the Indian market, but let's get you familiar with the powerful personality of the machinery. If I could direct your attention to this audiovisual presentation. It's been called the debut of the year. It's one appreciation for design, for cabin class comfort, for thoughtful conveniences. But what is it that truly sets the new Sears apart? It's the smile of confidence. And now it's time to hear about the Sears story from the perspective of two men and their teams who made the Sears phenomenon happen. It's over to Raman San and Manohar San. Hello everyone, I'm Manohar Bhatt. And I'm CV Raman. And together we will share with you Maruti Suzuki's thinking behind the launch of Sears. The A3 segment is clearly one of the fastest growing segments in the automobile market today. We felt that it was important to consolidate our dominant position in the segment. And so, the strategy was to get some more share from the A3 Plus segment to achieve this. Though the A3 Plus segment is degrowing, unlike the A3 Minus segment, we felt that it still held a very strong potential. But in order to achieve this, we had to conceptualize a product that was truly an authentic sedan. And that meant we needed a design that doesn't compromise on rear seat space while looking elegant and sleek. Mileage was important too, as was ride quality and handling. The customer in this segment is looking for more than just a car. He or she is looking for an experience. And in creating this car, we kept in mind just that, an experience that will delight him. The core target group was identified as an executive in between 30 and 40 years of age with a family. Yes, friends. When we started designing this car, we made sure that every detail and every feature needed to be a delight to experience. From the elegant proportions to the seamless profile design, coupled with a strong shoulder line, everything comes together in the Sias to give it a unique look. And then we took this unique story into the interiors as well. With best-in-class convenience features inside the cabin, the Sias is a true delight to drive. And that's why we are sure that the Indian consumer would sit up and take notice of this offering. We have backed up the CS with a truly innovative marketing campaign. This combines offline and online media and has generated a lot of buzz and a lot of social conversations. And we are certain that with a brand ambassador like Ranveer, CS will appeal to a large section of the Indian consumer. Yes, we are certain that CS will make its way into the hearts and minds of not just the existing Maruti Suzuki customers, but also excite an entirely new customer segment. Now, let us take a deeper look at what makes the CS a truly authentic sedan. The elegance of its curves and the boldness of its design. The Sias's dynamic styling is what catches your attention first. And then, you notice the strong shoulder line and the impressive stance that makes heads turn. The new Sears is the longest and one of the widest sedans in its class. 
translating into a roomier back seat and best in class comfort for those long drives. Loaded with conveniences and utilities, what will strike you are the many thoughtful cabin features that make the Siaz experience truly special. Add to that the Suzuki Tech Assurance in safety features. An undeniable invitation to go on a really long drive out of the city. What's more, the style icon comes loaded with the Maruti Suzuki Promise. Powered by a refined K14B petrol engine and DDI S200 diesel engine, you are assured of the best overall mileage. In September 2014, one of the most competitive segments in the Indian automobile industry witnessed a never-before phenomenon. The CS debuted in the Indian market with the Open for Booking launch, a multimedia integrated campaign that caught the imagination of the entire country and got everyone talking. The CS debut has received the warmest welcome from the people who matter most to us. Our customers. A testimony to the enduring power of India's most loved automobile brand. Thank you for your trust, ladies and gentlemen. It's time now. Get set to make way for CS. gentlemen get set for a musical journey that resonates with the distinct style and the smooth elegance of the Siaz. Winners of India's Got Talent 2010, this stupendous choir has performed all over the world for some of the most prestigious events with the most high profile of clientele, including Barack Obama in his visit to India. They have a reputation of leaving their audiences spellbound with their breathtaking performance. Please help me in welcoming the immensely talented Shillong Chamber Choir and they will be accompanied by the internationally acclaimed DC Group for a scintillating performance that will leave you feeling energized. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready to make way for the Siaz. No 
kick against modern jazz Unless you try to sway too darn fast And lose the beauty of the melody Until it sounds just like a symphony That's why I go for that rock and roll music Any old way you choose it It's got a backbeat, you can lose it Any old time you use it It's gotta be rock and roll music If you wanna drive with me If you wanna drive with me I took my darling in my new seat See she could hear the band and feel the snaps I must admit they had a rockin' band But in her mind it was my newest to damn That's why I go for that new sea as magic You just gotta choose it It won't sleep, yes, I'll lose it Everyone lies and lose it It's gotta be sea as If you wanna drive with me If you wanna drive with me
If I could now request uh, Ayu Kawasan and Mr. R.S. Kalsi, Executive Director, Marketing and Sales of Marathi Suzuki, to please join us on stage for a photo opportunity. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you got your pictures. Beautiful cars with such unique colors. MD San, if I could request you now to please uh, unveil the price of this Yaz in the Indian market. It's a tie. Now, can we have a price slide, please? Introducing price.
Gentlemen, for uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure you have a lot of questions. We're going to have a short question answer session. If I could request Mr. C. V. Raman, Executive Director, Engineering, to also join us uh, on stage here. Thank you very much, sir. We have uh, our people, our colleagues, my colleagues will be in the audience with their mics. If you just raise your hand, they'll come across to you. You'll be able to ask your questions, and the gentleman here will oblige. Ayukawa san, here on your right, sir. Right. Uh, the prices are very aggressive. I was just wondering when we can have a new powertrain from Maruti, because the regular engines we have been seeing in other models also. Can we expect some more aggressive uh, technology coming in new engines with new cars? New development and the technology that uh, any time we are, you know, uh, considering it that uh, planning. Uh, but today that we introducing a new car, this is a quite challenging, uh, you know, segment for us. Please enjoy this one, please, first. Sir, the predecessor SX4 couldn't create much ripples in the and competition was far ahead of the car. The I don't want to take any names. Uh, with Sias, what kind of a strategy you have to become a segment leader? Any time that we are expecting to do that. Uh, Ayukawa-san, this is Leishemba from PTI. I just wanted to understand from you, in the, uh, just as my previous colleague has uh, mentioned about your SX4. So how significant is Sears in terms of uh, your company in trying to make its presence felt in the bigger car segment? Can you just elaborate on what are, what are the kind of things that you would be putting in uh, so that this, become, this model becomes a success for you? I think that, uh, as I mentioned in my speech, uh, India customer is expecting the upgrading curve. That's why we are focusing the new segment, which at uh, CS, uh, the India uh, customer is expecting the good, seg uh, good sedan curve. That's why we developed this guy that, that uh, presented that, uh, this car to Indian market. So does that mean that going forward, we would be seeing some more bigger sedans from uh, your company? First, we are challenging this model, and then we have, the, if they are demanded, that we have to consider. Um, two questions, please. Uh, one, uh, I, I've had the pleasure of driving this car, uh, and uh, the first question is that the styling is a, a little conservative, a little sober compared to some of your competitors. Are you deliberately trying to aim at a slightly older target audience? Question two, uh, these cars both have small engines. Now the small engine technology is now sh uh, shown that many small engines give very good performance and power. And when I drove this car for two days, I have to say that I had no complaint about the pickup or performance. Uh, but the point is that for the public, this uh, car will be viewed as being having small engines as compared to some of your immediate competitors. Uh, so, how are you going to, to overcome that in terms of public perception? I think it, that, thank you very much. Uh, I appreciate your evaluation of the car. Uh, you have already draw, 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 driven that car. I, I request any time to the old you know, customer to try to drive this car. You can recognize the drivability of this car, excellent. You know? Even though the small engine, but the performance is very nice at the fuel efficiency. It's the best of the tech in, 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 in the market. Those kind of merit we have. Also, styling, he said, a little conservative. I feel elegant. Uh, anyway, that, uh, I, I presented it through the discard to have an ownership of the uh, pressure of the ownership of the, the, this kind of segment, uh, sedan of the Indian customer. First, could you try to drive this car? That is a, from my message. My message. Sir, you, you said you will use 98% local component in this car. So, this is only for this car or this policy will be, um, would be applicable for all your cars? Localization wise, uh, component wise, uh, almost our car is at over 95%. It's already 95%. Uh, sir, yeah. It's uh, more than 600 crores uh, already spent for research and development. So it is enough uh, the forest, the car is the 
the amount is a huge amount is spent for the research and development it's a quite difficult question then <laughs> In case about the R&D no investment, that, uh, not uh, only one time, continuously to you know uh, to make an investment. That's why this is, this cow is also the, the one milestone. Future make you know coming a more better uh, you know product. I believe. Thank you. Just to add to this, uh, the total investment on this model is 620 crores, and as MD Sana said, we continuously. You know, are uh, doing R&D and technology development, and that's a, a totally different figure altogether, uh, which is a continuous process. Uh, sir, you have a conventional automatic transmission in this car. However, uh, lower down your uh, own portfolio, the Celerio gets AMT. In the same segment, we have DSGs and CVTs. So, are you planning to continue with this transmission in future as well? Or will the CR see a difference in automatic transmission maybe sometime in future? Uh, at this point of time, we are, uh, uh, we'll be having the four-speed AT. And uh, you said rightly, uh, at the lower end, we have the AMT, uh, which has been proven to be a very successful technology. And we believe that in this uh, segment, uh, if you see the benchmarks, uh, I think uh, we have, uh, we're quite confident that with the four-speed AT, we'll be able to give challenge to the other competition. Hi, uh, Ayu Gavasan. This is Amrit here from Mint newspaper. My question is related to CRs, but not in a direct manner. Uh, out here, uh, right in front of you. Here. Uh, my question to you is, 10 days uh, ahead of the launch, your chief operating officers for marketing and sales, Mayank, Sari, Mayank Pari quit to join Tata Motors. And earlier this year, we have seen some uh, top level reject. Uh, it seems that there is some sort of transition or transformation happening at Maruti. Can you give us an idea that uh, why was this done? Was there any need, need for the same? And especially given the timing at, at what it is happening is slightly surprising to us. Now that the company has uh, you know, uh, history about 30 years, uh, I mentioned that uh, you know, uh, I, when I came to the company, it, time has come, to, we have to change. Uh, Unfortunately, that uh, some people left, but uh, new, some new people coming to that uh, internally at the outside. Those kind of you know changing will be necessary in order to survive the company in the forever. I believe. Uh, could you specify what change are you looking at when you say that the company needs to change? I think through the performance, could you uh, look at that uh, our company changing? Would you say that people who uh, have been, uh, you know, moved aside or people who quit were, were not appropriate for the changes that Maruti is looking forward to have? I don't think so. That uh, people have it their own way. That uh, people decided that uh, you know, uh, individual way. That's why that uh, uh, Mr. Mayanka they're leaving the company and that find out a new way. That's only that. I believe that. All right. So thank you very much. Hi there, I'm Tommy Wilkes at Reuters here. Um, just two quick questions. Can you tell me how many of these cars you expect to sell next year and which countries will you export the cars to? Uh, we, are, we are planning at the, some uh, Middle East country and some other you know, South American area. Also, some area of Europe we are planning. And how many cars do you expect to sell in India? In case of India, as much as possible, but uh, we are planning about over the uh, 60,000, between the 60,000 and 80,000 uh, first year. That's the first year, 60 to 80,000 in one year? Depend on the market demand, we try to increase. We have enough capacity. But that's 60 to 80,000 next year, 2015. Okay, thanks. I go Sandro Nendra from Business Line, uh, straight ahead, yeah. Uh, it's been uh, two, three months, uh, your mini car segment has been uh, falling in sales, uh, especially Alto, Wagonar, uh, now Celerio, I think also. So what's your plan towards this mini segment? Because 
Maruti is known for the small car, as a small car major. We, I think that the way, uh, we are, our analysis is a little bit different from you. Uh, small car the segment is still the going, growing, I, we believe. As far as that, uh, we, we take care about the market, uh, new you know, customers are increasing in this market. Uh, Ayukawa-san, this is uh, Sumant Banerjee from Hindustan Times. Uh, sir, in the past we have seen that Maruti has struggled to sell premium cars in India because of the brand perception that it is a very good, proficient small car maker, but customers do not trust premium end cars from the company and that is why Kizashi or Grand Vitara or even the SX4 and the Baleno, all of these cars did not do very well. How confident are you that Siaz will be able to undo that and what has changed? How, how are you going to convince customers to trust a Maruti car which is premium in nature? We have to enhance our quality, not only product at the sales and the service, etc. I believe that we have a confidence, the good network in the nationwide. And then we present the product, good product to the customer. Uh, we believe that uh, this will be uh, to uh, discover with that uh, open the new way uh, in the market. Also to add to that, uh, you know, we have market leadership in A3 minus segment. Now we have a huge mass of our uh, customers who have uh, trust and confidence in Maruti to put exact number on that about 1.4 million customers who are using uh, Swift and Desire. Now they are the ones who are waiting to upgrade themselves to higher uh, segments and uh, A3 uh, plus segment. Uh, I think Siaz is going to be a natural upgrade for them. So we are quite confident on that front. Any other questions? I don't think we have any other questions. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. Thank you, gentlemen, for giving us all that information and insight. We're certainly looking forward to uh, hearing more from you. I invite you now, our friends from the media, to come have a look for yourself. Remember, drive happy, drive safe, and more importantly, after this, uh, please do join us for lunch in the Maharaja Lounge, which is up there. Thank you so much for joining us. I hope you had a great time, and have a great day. Thank you. <laughs>